I'm here with Dr. Manny Coley and I speak to him about Doxypep implementation and concerns about antimicrobial resistance. So with Doxypep, what we're seeing is we're seeing clinical trial data, we're seeing real world data, we're even seeing population level data, for instance, from San Francisco. Why is this so important? I mean, it's, it's great to see all of that presented here at Croy. I think um, you know, we've seen rising STI rates across the board, across the world, um, and we need something to actually to, to curb that trend. And it's really great to see the data from San Francisco that actually they're seeing a population level benefit already. And you know, we need something in our arsenal to actually tackle STIs in the UK. Are there differences regarding the concerns about resistance using doxypep versus using an antibiotic prophylactically for malaria, for instance? So I do think there is value judgment happening here and because this is uh, primarily something that we're looking at using to benefit you know, gay and bisexual men and also um, trans women, I do think that it's being treated differently. We use antibiotics all the time in healthcare, we use it to prevent other types of infections um, and actually I think the bar has been set much higher here um, by some people with regards to antibiotic resistance concerns. It's important, I'm not denying that, um, but this is an evidence-based, efficacious use of antibiotics and that will benefit our patients. In terms of implementation specifically, uh, what are some of your concerns about getting doxypep out to people who most need it? So I think it's really important we don't make the same mistakes that we made with HIV prep rollout. And so we need to think about implementing it and targeting the people most uh, who would benefit most. So that's obviously gay, bisexual and, and other men who have sex with men, trans men and women, um, and particularly those from racially minoritized groups um, who we know actually were, are disproportionately impacted um, by STIs um, in the UK.